All right. You guys know how much I love me some Jack. Jack is too much fun to play. But in this game, he was even worse to fight against than in Tekken 7. A lot of people say, yo, dude, man, Jack is so, your Jack is so annoying to fight, or, or, um, Get ready you know, how do I deal with Jack? And, you know, I heard he's bad, but he really plays, like, great and stuff, and it's like, Jack was never bad to begin with. It's just in Tekken 7, he's so honest. You know, but in this game, all of that can go out the window. Because of two moves I'm going to show you. But first of all, I wanted to talk about how it was funny because a lot of um, um, people, like, so Bob was tearing up the scene and all that, right? But it wasn't until after Tekken Tag 2 was released when people were like, wait a minute. Um, Jack in this game is just crazy. And it's because of two things. Was this move, which you see me spam 24 7 on Tekken 7. This one's even worse. I'm going to show you why. And this move. Now they fix it in Tekken 7. But I'm going to show you why this move is ridiculously OP. So, first of all, we got the ridiculously OP low. Right? This thing, you already know, good range, you know, all that. Look at that range. Look at that, from here, boom. Look how quick it is, too. Alright. The reason why this low is amazing, because in Tekken 7, like, you are plus, right? But in here, you're plus 12. And on block, it's even worse. You're safe when it's on block. I believe it's minus seven or eight. You're safe. So you can do this constantly. Non-stop. Look at the range too. It's so funny because you don't even need to do anything jet like any of these. You don't need to do this. You don't need to do anything. Anything Jack does, you don't need to do. If you wanna win, all you have to do these two moves. And now I'm gonna talk about this move, just how ridiculous the OP it is. So, I believe on block you are only minus two. And you are, you are, first of all, minus two on block, and that's the kind of stuff you gotta deal with. It's how annoying that is, excuse me. Mid, mid. Mid mid, it's not even a high, it's mid mid. Right? So you're minus two on that, and I believe on block. Or is it plus? Are you plus on block or minus? I know either way you're safe, but I, I want to say only minus, like, either minus two or you're plus two. One of those. But there's that, and then. Um, on hit, I believe you're plus, like, four or something. So, you know, it's your turn still, again. And then, on top of that, you still have one more mid you gotta look out for, just in case. You know, you did a good job being plus, being safe on block, guarding this. Also looking out for that low. Yeah. So needless to say, Jack in this game, and if, oh my god, god forbid you get on the wall with Jack. 
if you are on the wall with Jack, it is game over. Because this becomes just, just it, there's no way to get around it. Not only is it no way to get around it when you're on the wall, but it's also homing. So if you try to sidestep, it's, it's game over. You got this to worry about. See, you have this to worry about. Now they're on the wall and they can't go anywhere while you're doing this as well. Here, while going here. While standing forward, go back into this. That's what I would do. If somebody was on the wall, I'd literally just do this all day. While standing forward, boom, go back into this. And I come here or they gotta guess whether I'm gonna go into one plus two or down back one. It, it's just, it, it, he's just insane because of those two moves alone. You don't need anything else to play Jack. Like that, those two moves alone are what make him a menace to play. And people, you know, complain about him in Tekken 7 sometimes. You should have played him in this game. This is what makes me say that it's him and Bob that are tied with Lars as well, but I mean, it's debatable. I'd say it's Bob, Lars, and Jackson because at least Lars is fat. Is he has ridiculous tools that can cope with what this guy does. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, peace.